Ay bomo ne gente ayeke no no zo na robo sinketa bo 25 of December 2023 ay school no happy christmas and new year na de go se de ay ma no no fuma stay safe bo bo ni sine so ra ni ya na me na eastern news 24 ibo ni ibo ni bo ni edo ibo ni bi ni akwa ibo ni bo ni nugu Onya Bia, Imo State, Port Harcourt, all the Eastern Legions, stay safe. Now this is Mars. I start to go to Kabi, my Anna, I don't need enough love for you. I try to go to the hotel, I try to go to the hotel. I try to go to the hotel. I will tell you on Christmas brokers from the office of Biafra Prime Minister of Biafra Republic of Mentineza. When you say, Bo, my Simon Eba, or before we tell I, my chocon gay, before the case here, on a drop or your own comment on the commission bureau. Right over to you, sir. I'm not going to back down. In addition to all the things I've said today, remember that European Union have said that uh, Russia have violated all the laws, and I want to also draw similarity to the Nigeria state, how Nigeria state have violated their own laws and also their own promise made immediately after the Biafra Nigeria genocidal war. And I want you to listen to how this war and how this promise were violated against the Biafra people. The tragic chapter of violence is just ended. We are at the dawn of national reconciliation. Once again, we have an opportunity to build a new nation. But we have Colonel Obasanjo, who is the commander of three Marine Commando, who have been able to capture a number of senior secessionist officers and he had brought them to Lagos to see us in order to let us have the acceptance of the spirit of one Nigeria. And I would like therefore to take this opportunity to say that I, Major General Philip Ephium, officer administering the government of the Republic of Biafra now wish to make the following declaration that the Republic of Biafra hereby ceases to exist. Hello. Your Excellency. Let's see you again. My pleasure. How are you? Very well indeed. Let's see you again. Thank you. Patrick Amadi. How are you? Excellency. Glad to see you again. Thank you very much. Glad to see you again. It's an experience. Honestly. Now, I want you to understand that he said that I have started the process of reconciliation. That never happened. Nigeria betrayed that particular, violated that particular promise. The tragic <laughs> chapter of violence is just ended. We are at the dawn of national reconciliation. They are the dawn of national reconciliation. National reconciliation never happened till today. They have killed us in millions. And we are now saying that we cannot continue to watch you kill us again. And we must not validate you again this year. Over 60 years, you said you are on the national reconciliation. Yet, you deploy military to our land to bomb us and kill us. And we are saying we will not validate you again. We are ready to fight once and for all and we'll fight again and again. Because this time around, there is social media. And social media is making the huge difference. Because the social media, without the social media, Finland will not be talking what they are talking today. Without the social media, Europe will not be hearing what they are hearing today. In the 60s, when you were killing us, nobody knew what was going on. You made a blockade. Kunai with the British government to starve Biafra people to death. And millions of children were dying and nobody knew what was going on. Today, we are here with social media and we have exposed your impunity, your criminality to the world. And the world have come to know you. They know how you sponsor terrorism. They know how you blackmail us by coming out to kill people during our seat at home and blame it on us. And yet, it did not stop us from still to from still ordering the seat at home that we have been ordering every day. So on this note, we are going to bring the brokers to an end and we are going to receive call. So if you receive call that uh, we open the line, uh, you can call us and give us your opinion or feedback on the brokers and the exposition or the analysis we have done today, drawing comparison with the Ukraine crisis and from the unique 
Security Conference in Germany. Thank you very much. And the phone number and the phone line is open for your call. And this calling is going to last for the next 30 minutes or so. And we call it a day. Thank you very much. One minute per person. And we move. You're welcome. You must go and listen to Simon and Epa. He's doing a very fantastic job. Very great job that Simon and Epa is doing. Very, very, absolutely fantastic job that he's doing. You must listen to him and share his videos accordingly. Very, very important. He is bringing a new dimension to this very awareness that we are making. And you must listen to him. Very, very important. I want you to understand that uh, today it is very, very clear that uh, 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 the criminals that have been expelled, you know, betrayed Biafra to the highest. They betrayed Onyendu to the highest. You can imagine where the criminal called Emma had the opportunity to tell a Finnish journalist about Biafra, to tell Finnish journalists about the plight of Mazen and Bikano. To tell Finnish journalists why Biafra people are sitting at home every Monday. He left that and started blackmailing Samonekwa that Samonekwa is not IPOB member. Samonekwa is not this. Samonekwa is not that. They have told Samonekwa to go and uh, open his own movement because it is entrepreneurship to them. That career, if they have told Samonekwa to go and open his own movement, Samonekwa did not listen and all that. And they thought that, and he thought that after saying that, the Finnish journalists will begin to blackmail me with it. No, they draw a conclusion from that. It didn't affect me. Okay, they draw a conclusion. They say that the position of Simon Ekpa is not clear, but what they know is that they are France listening to Simon Ekpa. So who do you do? You are a failure. You have failed. I have defeated all of you since one and a half years and I will continue to defeat you anywhere, any day, any time. And you people have been defeated and you can never rise up again. Yet, because of that, I have released the memo. The memo I released, which uh, was a memo of uh, Onyendu, forbidding you people from responding to me. But what did you do? They were responding and attacking me and blackmailing me just to show the hatred. Onyendu. And today, this is where we are. Onyendu say, you are forbidden from responding to Simon Ekpa, no matter what. It is still the number one in the commandment. The commandment of Onyendu, number one commandment, do not respond to Simon Ekpa, no matter what. Did you obey it? No. You have betrayed Onyendu, but Onyendu have defeated all of you in us. In us, he has defeated all of you. You are all unbelievable. You, you slander my name, called me names, call me owner of names. That thing in Finland. Nobody. This one. This one. That one. No, uh, Alejandro Okoro. That number 11 is irrelevant. It's completely irrelevant. So that's why that's why uh, uh, it is covered. So forget it. If it is something very important, of course, you know I cannot uh, hide it. It is not important. It is uh, irrelevant. It is very, very irrelevant. So that's why it is covered. It's not, it's not, uh, it's irrelevant. If it is something that will help the struggle, I will, uh, I will make it public, of course. So now, the reason why I make the number one public is because this idiot, instead of talking about Biafra, he went and started talking about Samonekwa. Somebody traveled all the way from Finland to come to Biafra land for fact finding. This guy had opportunity to tell, Bia to tell Biafra problem. He began to talk about Samonekwa, how Samonekwa is not an appeal to him. Welcome to the program. Hello? Hello?
Let me connect uh, You're welcome to the program. Please, can you listen to the uh, phone, please? Can yeah. you? Hello, Simon. Good evening. Good evening from here. Go ahead, please. Yeah. Yes, please. Very quickly. Um, thank you, man. Uh, you are you are you are a strong man. Um, I I I I remove my cap for you, and uh, I pray for you every time. Anyway, very quickly. Um, it is just um, astonishing um, how our people could be so mean. A people that have been killed for 60 years. Yes. Now, I remember since 2011, hundreds of thousands of our people have been killed in the north. I'm sure that every Igbo man has in one way or another been affected by the killing that have gone up over the years. Yes. And these people brought the killing to our land. From uh, issues or to Ihamufu to Atakaliki to Lutu everywhere. Yes. And just within a few months, the people who say they want to vote to be they have all forgotten all this. Completely. They have forgotten all this. Now, you joined IPOG when? 2019. Now, I remember, it, people have just forgotten that Nandi Kano launched ESN just about a year. I can't remember the exact day he launched ESN. But before he launched ESN, IPOG was a non-violent organization. Yes. They were just carrying flags, marching on the street. They were and that on Nisha. And they were getting killed. Hundreds of people were massacred at Onisha. Just carrying ordinary yes. flag. Simon Epa was not there. Mm -hmm. I uh, there was no ESN. I was not uh, you know violent. And at our back where people were praying, even at Onisha. The soldiers went into the church where people were praying at Onisha and them. massacred people. Yes. Simon, do you know, during the massacre at Onisha, do you know that the soldiers were also carrying acid? There was a guy I sent 50, I personally sent this guy 50,000 naira when I saw a video, this guy, or video, video of this guy on Facebook. Do you know that? The soldier shot this guy at Onisha. The guy fell into the gutter. They carried acid and poured on this guy. Do you know what? Hmm. The, the flesh in the entire leg of this guy got, in fact, disappeared. Oh you could God. only see the vein. I have never seen such thing in my life. I have never seen such. Now, these were the atrocity soldiers and our people, they have all, even, it, it's so shocking that even I told members could forget all this. Sorry. Anyway, I'm not going to go far, but I only want to remind our people. I tell people, I say, God forbid, God forbid that Simon fails. God forbid that this journey, that we don't get to where we're going to. Because it is, it, 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 you know, it's just, we, it, 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 it's better imagined. It's just better imagined what will before our people. But I pray and I hope that God will continue to strengthen you and we will surely get there. So, but it is good, Simon, finally, please, you always remind them. When they are shouting about sit at home, the reason sit at home was imbibed was because when our people do peaceful protest, they get massacred. Yes. And sit at home was in bad because it saves lives. Mm. That's why people were asked to sit at home. Because people get killed when they come out. And even now that you order sit at home because you want to save lives, they still kill people. Exactly. Now, when people were killed at Punisha, <coughs> was, was there any election? There was no, no election. Yes. Simon, let me stop here and give other people a chance. Thank you, thank I you very much. I want to thank you, my brother, and uh, I pray that God continue to strengthen you. Amen, amen. Thank you very much for that uh, wonderful uh, contribution.
Thank you. Thank you, sir. Bye-bye. All right, I will continue. And I want reasonable comments like this. Very important. You're welcome to the program. Hello. You're welcome to the program. Hello. 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 Right, he's not caught talking. <coughs> Good evening and welcome to the Hello. program. Yeah, thank you very much, Mose. Yes. Thank, I just want to commend you and uh, to tell you to increase the tempo. Thank you. Continue with what you are doing. I just listened to a demo interview with anger. <laughs> and if you look at the piece of journalism that they are doing, you will see that made. Yes. During the interview, they were playing a video of, of the protest, currency protest. Yes, yes. Let them continue. We know. Trying to use it. Yes. Mm. They are trying to use that protest as if it was incitement mm. from IPOB. Yes. So you see the deception of what is going on. Yeah, let them continue. Now, I think what is about to happen now. It's about Russia who wants to use their fight with Ukraine to attack other uh, uh, European countries to say, oh, they are so I think they are taking sides here. <laughs> well, we are, going to, we, are going to see how, we are going to see how it goes. Let them continue now. Yes, mm. the whole world is watching. Look, look imagine them in, 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 being a terrorist. They didn't <laughs> check the background of Adamu. Yes. Adamu is a man that openly said, Boko Haram are freedom fighters of the North. Yes. Adamu is the one that tweeted tweeted in support of the, the lynching of a Christian of a Christian girl. girl. Yes, yes. That's the man that we are viewing. A that, terrorist. That's why they banned the RT in, in Europe now. Yes, mm. a terrorist calling a freedom fighter a terrorist. Can you imagine that? Yes. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Uh, yes, it is getting interesting now because uh, they were joking. They thought we were joking before. Now they were on, they are now running kiti kiti kata kata, going from one uh, television to another to demand the Samanakpa arrest. I didn't see it coming. I thought that we are saying that uh, we are just social media noise makers. It is no longer social media, right? Hello. It is no longer social media uh, noise making. Hello. Hello. You're welcome to the program. No. 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 This is Marshall. Okay, like. Yes. Go ahead. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Uh, like uh, the last speaker said, you need to increase the tempo. But I want to make a comment about uh, this. Uh, the map powerless. What he did is beyond sabotage. Yes. It is beyond abomination. And it could be likened to an act of treason against his people. Yes. You know, so now I want to, to uh, uh, tell you, Marjorie Simon, that this kind of behavior, I don't know what you think. Well, don't, don't, go, don't, go, there, don't go there yet. Don't go there yet. We are now, you know, this uh, whole discussion now is, you know, is at the highest level. So. We have to be very reasonable, you understand? But uh, okay. when we go to that road, we will cross it. All right. Mm. All thank right. you, thank you. So what I'm saying here is that, uh, you understand, I, I equally uh, saw uh, this, this post uh, in Banka. And that's, that's when he, when he came out again, was a direct indictment mm. uh, of auto pilot acts. Mm. Yes. And uh, this kind of thing should not be happening. Yes. You understand? And that is why we, uh, I like what you are doing today. You know, so we need to equally uh, double the aggression in truncating. Of course, of course. Those, they, they should watch us. They should watch us. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yes. Why they are saying is online country, they are running mad. It's no longer online country, uh, Eleonora. <laughs> it's no longer online country. They are going to the Russian news now to talk about it. <laughs> I was thinking that... Uh, 
They say Biafra is online country. I did not know that. Uh, I don't know when we graduated from online country to the reality, uh, become a real country, because this one that they are going to Russia. All right, welcome to the program. Hello. Hello. Good, good evening, Simon Epa. Good evening from me. Angel. I'm calling from London. You're welcome. And I just wanted to comment, but first of all, I want to say thank you for what you're doing. Thank you for your faithfulness and diligence. Thank you. Thank you for taking us through. Thank you. We saw the lift today, and I was saying, we will not reinstate those that have betrayed us because we <laughs> cannot allow the rotten apple yes. inside the good apple, inside the good basket that we will be taking into our new nation. So if they have betrayed us on this journey, we are only merciful not to ask to take their life because we're not God. Yes. But we do not want them in our midst. Again. So we will disobey <laughs> Oni and Duke and we will not reinstate them. Yes. They must go. <laughs> for peace to reign and for you to take us through peacefully and successfully. Yes, sir. And I want to say good evening to all my dear friends' family. Thank and you. thank you for all of us listening to Simon Epa and knowing where we are going and what we truly want in life. Yes. No more, no more going back. This is it. Thank you very thank much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That's a very straight one. We continue. We continue. People are getting the message now. You know. You see, only the truth will stand the test of time. The time for lies. You can't, you, you can't lie and, uh, you know, you cannot continue to lie all the time and uh, continue to deceive people. One day, your lies will end. And today, the lies of the criminals have ended. And the truth is out. The truth is here. The truth is here. You're welcome to the program. Hello. Hello. You're welcome to the program. Yes. Uh, my name is Jordi from Atlanta, US. All right. I'm talking to Simon Eba. You are talking to Simon Eba. Go ahead. Okay. Hi, Mr. Simon. I want to thank you very much for all you do. Thank you. Uh, God will bless you and reward you as we look forward to the weekend when we become a new member. Yes. Um, I spoke with some of my uh, brother, brother in the uh, 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 last week. Is it last, the last program? It's the last program, yes. Okay, but I, what I'm still not is just for what I'm hearing from you. I'm not yeah, because it's anyway. a little bit probably some kind of delay. So don't look at the television, talk to me on the phone. Uh, the, the you tell them you tell them the reason now if you, if they have not had the reason you tell them the reason you, that is but that is why we are spreading the message it is not just about me so if you have the opportunity to talk to people and they don't have the reason you tell them the reason and they will pass the information to other people as well I I they have no idea that the people who want to vote is that they cannot be behind the government. Yes. Uh, this guy was the reason why. But when it comes to the vote and that's very important, uh, Nigerian government. Mm. And I was anyway, so I am, uh, yes, and I am uh, asking our media team to make jingle immediately, to release jingle immediately. We need a uh, jingle for this uh, no election and the demand for referendum and no election in Biafra land. We need a jingle. We need jingle for the seat at home. Uh, we need that jingle to release tomorrow. Media team, please take notes. Hmm. Yeah, they don't, these are people. These are people that doesn't have brain. Just forget about them. They know, they know that nobody is coming out from the 23rd in Biafra land. So we, we gave them two days ahead of time. All right. You're welcome to the program. Hello. Hmm. 
Eh, bon, mon égénte. Eh, d'allons l'inné, non, mon yé, fait. Mon chou. Connais-tu, ouais, n'est-ce pas, ouais, n'est-ce pas, 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 n'est-ce of December 2023 and a Christmas morning tea. Can you keep on the key? Come on, stop. Can you be fair? I see. Can you drop or I am on the commission below? Also, the key be able to stay safe. Never when you see when I join any name, a bony do a bony a new go an umbrella in most states. I be a state for the court. A quiet bomb, divorce, delta. Benue State, all the Eastern regions. Kabana alu, stay safe. Never be easy. When you see that, I'm going to come and see you no more.